Okay, welcome everybody to Drobo Intergalactic Headquarters here. I know several of you have, uh, have been at Drobo before in our other locations, and I'd like to welcome you to our new location that we moved into last July. I'm Tom Bioki, I'm the CEO of Drobo, and we're very, very happy to be here at our fourth Tech Field Day. I'm not sure if there's anybody, Stephen, what's the uh, lifetime ranking in terms of people sponsoring the most Tech Field Days? Where are we? We are tied for number two. We are tied for number two. We'd like to be number one someday. Too. And there are no there, there are no volume discounts as I understand who's, who's it. Who's number one? Yeah. yeah, who would be number one? Symantec. Um, <coughs> it, it actually is Symantec. Well, we are we're number one. They are okay. <laughs> that is big, that, sorry, that doesn't count. Um, some of you have have met Drobo before. We've known Drobo before. Who has uh, been at a tech field day with Drobo in the past? Okay, about half the crowd. We are a very different company than when you first met us, uh, I believe, four years ago or so. If you remember at that time, Drobo innovated to uh, automate RAID and data protection in a little four-bay Drobo that uh, might have contained a full terabyte or even two terabytes across the four drives. Uh, today we'll be showing you data-aware automated tiering between standard hard drives and SSDs in a 12-slot box that holds 18 terabytes of hard drive storage and three 200 gig SSDs all at once, all integrated in the same data pool, right? And we've grown quite a bit because whereas our deal size back in, back in the day four years ago might have been that one or two terabyte four bay Drobo for the, for the home user, uh, we recently have sold a 250 terabyte quarter petabyte deal of these 12 bay products to a Fortune 20 company. And you think that was a big deal. We recently, about a month ago, sold a one petabyte deal. Of that product, so we're, we're of one PB of Drobo in a single deal. Happy to tell you about the customer use case. They don't want it too much in the public, but uh, who would have thought Drobo sold a one petabyte deal to one customer at one time? But we're moving up the stack a little bit. I think when you see the technology today, you'll understand why that's happening. Um, today, our guys are going to show you that we've continued innovating. But in order to kind of put Drobo in context, especially from where you've been this morning, you got to put your SMB cap on. We are not an enterprise play. We are not a pure SSD. Except for that one petabyte deal. Except for the one petabyte deal, exactly. Um, we are not a, a big small company. We're a big small company. We're, we're not the billion IOP, all SSD, drag race, or Ferrari. So think of us using our technology to produce a unique value proposition at a unique price point for an SMB customer who doesn't have a staff of you guys around or the expertise or the budget that an enterprise has. So, um, I don't know if you read our press release today, but the analyst quote in the press release said, hey, Drobo didn't invent RAID, they just made it easy for everybody to use. They didn't invent thin provisioning or thin reclamation, they just included it in all their products for free and made it usable by everybody. And they didn't invent data tiering, but now they've made it slam dunk easy, zero config, and affordable by everybody. So today we'll be showing you that technology as a continuation of the innovation that our engineering team has been doing for the last several years. Again, we hope you appreciate the format. There'll be zero PowerPoint slides today. There'll be a lot of chalk talks here. Um, Mario Blandini's here, who many of you have met before. Uh, Eric Pounds runs product management here. Jim Shearhart runs marketing, you know him. And Rod Harrison is the chief architect for the Drobo technology. So he'll walk you through uh, how he architected the system and how he architected the uh, data tiering technology as well. Should be a lot of fun. So we hope you like what you hear. We hope you talk about it a lot. Um, I don't know what the world record is for um, number of tweets and blogs, but we hope you break it in the next two hours. Uh, feel very liberal in terms of sharing the information. And uh, I'm going to step stage left and, and move on. One thing I will like to say, though, in advance, at about 2.45 or 2.50, we will ask that the cameras go off momentarily because um, we're going to give you the N plus one Drobo announcement as well under a bit of an NDA embargo under that little... Uh, that little box there. So we'll ask for a moment of silence and cameras going off and then we'll kind of unveil that and Eric will take you through uh, what Drobo.next will be after today. That's okay, a little foreshadowing. Any questions of me? And otherwise I get to go back and make funny faces in the back of the room. Thanks for your time today and your attention. I know it's a long couple days, but uh, we think we have some cool stuff to show you here. Okay.